What's up you guys and welcome back to Darkwing Tips, Tricks and Reviews. I know it's been a minute since I've recorded a video. Um, I've been kind of busy at work doing things. I'm trying to get a promotion at work and stuff. And anyways, you don't want to hear about all that shit. So today what I'm going to be showing you guys is how to set up another user account on your Windows system. I find this very useful if say I have a virus or something like that and then so this profile this uh, username user account has a virus so when I start the computer up nine times out of ten the virus is in the start program so it'll start up by itself there's a way to circumvent that and it doesn't always work but just sometimes it does so you will log into the second account that you made and it doesn't start the same programs that you you'd run on your normal account so then after that you can always uh, run antivirus and find the program or you know do it manually there's lots of help out there to do that in any case so this is how you do it start menu control panel user accounts and family safety Add or remove account user accounts. You can either click on this or click on this. I'm just gonna click on this right now. So, got Fennel Gaming Guest. Guest is off right now, so I'm just gonna add another account. Create a new account. Um, test account. And we're not. This is standard user, and I don't make it an administrator. I only do that for one account. That's my main one. This is going to be a standard. You can do most things with a standard account that, you know, so it doesn't really matter. Create account. And there you go. So when you log in from now on, it's going to ask you which account you want to log into. You can, from here, you can set passwords, you know, change account name, change password, picture, parental controls, account type, delete the account, whatever you want to do. Anyways, I hope you guys find this useful, and stay tuned for another video from Dark One Tips, Tricks, and Reviews. Peace.